Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's video, I'm sitting in a 2020 Ford Edge and I will show you which fuels to check in case your rear defroster is not working. This video will apply to Ford Edges made from 2015 all the way up to 2024. If this video was helpful, please consider supporting the channel by liking the video, subscribing to the channel or becoming a channel member. Okay, now the fuse you want to check is located in so-called hidden fuse box, which is under the main fuse box. So this is the main fuse box. And what you have to do, you have to unclip it, lift it up, flip it to the side, remove the bottom cover, and then you will get the access to the fuse you need. So I will try to turn on the flash on my phone so you can see what I'm doing. Now to unclip the main fuse box, you'll have two black tabs. One will be just here, you see, you want to unclip this one and you will have one more of the same kind just under this uh, connector down here. Now to access it, you want to go from here and then just unclip it. I'm not sure I'll be able to record it, but it's right here. See, so I want to unclip it and lift up and do that on both of these. And once you have the main fuse box nice and loose, um, you still have to unclip it down there. There's like a four black tabs which are holding it in place. So what you will do, you will lift it up and then push it here towards the air box. Now this is a bit of a struggle to do sometimes. Okay. And then you will lift it and flip it to the side. And to access the fuses, you want to remove this cover. And again, you'll have two black tabs. You see one here on the right side and one on the opposite side as well. Okay, and here are all the fuses. And on the back side of the cover, you will also have a small fuse diagram. And the fuse you want to check, it's a fuse number 68, which is 40 amp fuse located here. Now, in case this fuse proves to be good, then you'll have to dig a bit deeper. First, you want to make sure uh, rear, rear defroster uh, switch is operational. And then next thing I will check, I will check the heating elements on the uh rear window right on the on the glass itself if there is a crack or something then they will probably not work and the last thing to check will be the wiring but hopefully this will fix your problem thank you for watching this video i hope it was helpful and educational if it was please like it and consider subscribing to my youtube automotive channel on my channel there is lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews and other similar automotive topics.